Hello, hello. This is Snow Plays the Walking Dead, Season 3, A New Frontier, Episode 1. I have Carmi with me here today. Hello. And, oh boy, this is... I hate how they always have it... <laughs> I was just telling Carmi that I was messing around with the settings, and they're like, adjust the brightness so the logo is barely visible, and I'm like, fuck nah, and turning that shit up. We need light! Ooh, choose how to begin your story. Okay. Continue. Um, excuse me, just Import. Oh, God. She said goodbye. Okay, let me just... Plop the link to this sh my channel in some places. Oh boy, I'm ready for the Yanks. Okay, gonna just slap that onto my Twitter. Here soon, I should have a friend joining. Nice! The more people, the merrier. I agree. And a tumbler. I'm glad the view count is increasing. Yeah, I actually got somebody that subscribed to my channel and it made me so happy! Oh wait, don't you have like seven people now already? Wait, do I? I, I, I don't- I, I don't know, I can't see. <laughs> Oh, you have six followers now. I shall be the seventh one. Alrighty! That should be it. Let's start. Let's check out this Wellington place. Nope. Nope. Hi, is that by part oh. one? When Javier okay, and his him. family accidentally cross paths with a rival group, a simple misunderstanding quickly spirals out of control. Start episode one. Oh boy. <laughs> I always get nervous about my choices. The butterfly effect. <sighs> hey. It's time. Get over here. Alright, I'll, uh... I'll start packing up. Wait, now, isn't the guy's name, like, hurry. Javier or something? Look, I'm not giving you shit. Okay? I'm just... You weren't here when Dad was 
sick, okay? I get it, but you need to fucking be here when he goes. I know. All right, I'm just on my way. <sighs> Shit. Uh-oh. David! It's David, hey! Hey, David. I had to leave my car. It's, traffic's just it's backed up for miles. He's dead. No. No. I, I, I tried. You're a piece of shit. You know that? David, one really? Time, he just tried. Just the one goddamn time that you needed to be here. I tried. Please, I tried. Oh, you tried. You fucking tried? What the fuck? Everyone's here. Whoa, They've been here bro. for days. And where the fuck were you? <clears throat> we're there, all around him. People who love him all around him. And he's scared. I'm seeing the panic in his eyes and he's searching the room. Donde esta Javier? Donde esta mi hijo? I'm there, right beside him, holding his I hand. I was right, that's his name, okay. Like a good okay. son. And he doesn't even see me. He doesn't even see me because he's looking for you. You don't think there's a million places we'd rather be? You don't think we all had to make sacrifices? Shit, man. I'm sorry. Okay? David, Jesus. I sorry isn't bringing him back. You selfish fuck. Uncle Javi? Why, why are you fighting? I could hear you from inside. What's going on? Nothing but we were just uh, oh talking, God. Gabriel. Right. Your uncle and I are just having a little chat. Go inside, Mijo. We'll be in in a minute. Go on. It's okay. Inside. Fucking David. <sighs> I should call someone, pick up the body. Yeah. Ouch. I love you, little brother. Sure doesn't you know seem that, right? like it. With everything going on. I know. You think I was jealous of you? No, I, I don't think anything. Well, I was. For a long time. You've lost more than I'll ever have. But maybe something good can come out of all this. Because we need you here. It's time to grow up. You can't run from this. Not anymore. I know. You're right. I won't even argue. I'll be around more, honestly. You can count, count on, on it. it, huh? I want to believe that. I do. Javi. Kate. I'm so sorry, Javi. I'm so sorry. Thank you. Let's go inside. Your mom needs you. What happened? Come on. Baby Hobby. Mama. Where were you? I tried. I tried. I'm so sorry. He's gone, mijo. He's gone. 
He's in a better place, Mama. David made arrangements with your father before he passed. Telltale presents. No puedo conectarme. Uh, Dicen que no hay servicio. Why do you do this to me? In association with Skybound Entertainment. You thirsty, baby? You want some juice? Grandpa's cup was empty. That was the sound of my head. You don't have to fill his cup up anymore, baby. Grandpa is sleeping. No, Yaya. Pipo's awake. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. Ah. Uh. I have too many tabs open. Fuck. Rafa, how is this possible? The bite that does it. <laughs> it's gonna happen oh, to all of us. Oh, Rick. Papa, papa, cálmate. Soy yo, David. Estás en tu ¿Qué casa, cálmate. ¿Qué está haciendo? Él está loco. Él atacó a Héctor. Solamente está confundido. Mamá. No, she's gonna get bit. Oh my god! Oh my god! He ate her face! It's okay! It's okay! Mama, you're gonna be okay! You'll be okay, Mom! Help him! Help him! David! I'm sorry, Papa! We need to go. We need to get her to the hospital. Let me look at it. Let me look at it. Gabrielle, where's your sister? Gotta love the zombie outfit. Keys! Huh? Where the fuck are the keys? Take Dad's car. <laughs> keys are on the dash. Fuck. She bit. Mama, get the kids. Meet at the hospital. Don't take the highway. It's blocked. <sighs> I'll bring the van around. Where's Mari? I, I don't know. Mija. Mariana! From the stars! Mariana, we have to go. Yaya's hurt. Come on, honey, we have to go. No, no, no! 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 It's okay. No. It's okay. County General Hospital. I know the way. Shit, he got bit. Ooh. It's blue. Why is it blue? The fuck? Alien zombies. <laughs> Shit, look at all of them. First, or present day. Tell me when it reaches the campfire. Man, I don't think I've seen this many. It's definitely growing. Yeah, not a great sign. Damn it. How 
left my the water bottle. Her just got there. Just under four hours. Come on. We should keep moving while the kids are asleep. Yeah. Also, I am very quiet. Yeah. You are very quiet. Hi, Robin. It looks like the herd is speeding up a little. I thought it was drifting southwest, but I'm not sure anymore. Every time I think we should just bed down somewhere and wait for it to pass, I can't shake the thought of us getting caught in the middle of it. It just keeps coming. It's slow, but that almost makes it worse. It makes it feel like we're in control. We should keep moving. It worked for us so far. As long as we stay supplied, we're fine. Yeah, Thank maybe you. you're right. The van isn't so bad. We'll figure it out. We always do. Hey, I'm gonna sneak a smoke. I can't believe you found weed. Are you kidding? People were probably growing this before they realized they needed food. Who does food. he look like? He looks like somebody from Resident Evil. All right, just... You know, make it quick. He kind of I don't want like you waking the kids. Relax. Mariana's got headphones on and Gabe is drooling. I think we're in the clear. You want some? Nah. No thanks. One of us should be... sober. <laughs> don't judge me. Oh, when I found out David had kids, I told him I am not changing who I am around them. <laughs> and when he proposed, I reminded him that I'm not exactly stepmother material. <laughs> Case in point. He was reassuring, but yeah, you know, I could tell he was worried about it. I knew he'd try to get me to change. <laughs> or at least he'd hope that being around the kids more would change me, you know? I suppose it did. If it helps, I think you're doing a fine job. <laughs> Don't be cheesy, all right? I'm not fishing for compliments. Well, you caught one, all right? So, now what? I used to talk shit about all those mothers who'd go on about raising their kids being the hardest thing in the world. Oof. Gabe's making me start to think they had a point. His mood swings are just, oh, I don't know. Some days I just want to leave him by the side of the road. <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> Jesus, obviously. You really shouldn't say things like that. I said it was a joke. It's half a joke. It's all joke. Look, I love these kids, but I could do without Gabe reminding me I'm not his mother whenever he's pissed. He's a teenager. Puberty. Hormones. The second you start getting boners, the whole world starts to get dark. <laughs> what are you talking about? Sounds delightful compared to dealing with bloody underwear. He's not wrong. <laughs> Christ. I need to get laid. I realized that was an awkward transition. Sorry about that. Come on, Kate. You know we can't do that. <laughs> Who said I meant with you? Hmm. Ugh. What's that smell? That's gross. Hey, Mariana. Shouldn't you be, uh, sleeping or, or something? I already know you guys do drugs. That's a pretty severe way of way phrasing really it, Mariana. Awkward. Don't tell Gabe. He's... Hold up, I need to change the settings. Audio... Is... I need to turn... Because I need to hear you. <laughs> oh, for yeah, I'm, I'm really quiet. Apply. 
or Zoom? The one who told me. Ugh. Oh my god. You're even smoking in the car now? All right. Everyone roll the windows down before you all get contact high. We're about to make a supply stop. Family road trip. Yay! Oh god, that van looks like it's seen better days. It's better than not having a van at all, though. Yep, definitely. Uh, probably not best to make a supply stop in the middle of the fucking night. Bloody front of the car. <sighs> Gee, I wonder how many people they've had to hit. You want a moment alone, Mari? I'm praying I find a candy bar. <laughs> All right. What do we actually need? Uh, a candy bar. I felt that. Need, Mariana. Not want. Uh, a water bottle? <laughs> All right. Well, let's start with some gas and move up from there. <laughs> These Shit. people are way too hopeful. Hello. And one more time. Oh boy, that was a hard hit. Hey, where are you going? Gabe, okay, that's cool. Have fun. Oh, Jesus. It never ends with him. I hate when they fight like that. I really hate it. It's like, all Gabe wants to do is argue. Doesn't matter what it's about. Hey, I know, that's what families do. They fight, they make up, and they fight all over again. At least you have your headphones. Yeah, but the batteries have been dead for a couple of weeks. I mostly wear them to fool you guys. <laughs> you, you sneaky little... That's smart. That's pretty smart. Be nice to find some dinner. In Imagine a junkyard. Having a family you never know. Outbreak. These past four years, people have been hoarding all kinds of shit in all kinds of places. Oh, and Mari, if there's any trouble, you can find one of these cars. Yeah? Lock yourself in and don't come out. Not even once it's quiet. And wait as long as you can. Okay. Good girl. Good plan. Mm. Oh, God, that uh. sucks. Hey, any luck, kiddo? I need a pen. Or a pencil. Just something to write with. Yeah, I guess you are a little too old for crayons now. I guess so. Last night I was thinking about this stupid story my mom used to tell me all the time before bed. I used to hate it. But... But then I realized I don't remember the ending. It was this goofy ending she thought was so funny and I thought was so dumb. Oh. I want to write down everything I can remember about everything. Because if I forget, and they're all gone, I'm kind of gone too. At least a little bit. Oh, baby. I just think that might be kind of important. That's a great idea, Mariana. Yay. Look at barrels. Let's look at them. 
Waste oil. No use to us. It occurred to me you don't know me by Toby, holy shit. <laughs> Most of the dashboard is torn out, seats are gone. Ah, this thing's dead. <laughs> Whoa! Wow, you can actually see things now. <laughs> Just rotting bits of old rubber and tires. I didn't know that rubber rotted. I thought it was like inorganic. Nothing good it left. Depends on the Someone picked it clean. Rubber. Oh gosh, I think that <laughs> Yuka is a bit behind. Very. Oh, that's gross. I'm gonna poke it. Okay, now I'm sorry I did that. <laughs> You find anything? I can't stop thinking about that herd. We get caught in it, and, and that's it. Peace, asshole. Can't charm your way out of that one. And we'd be gone in seconds. Hey, don't think about that. We're careful. We're smart. We'll stay ahead of them. <sighs> Luck runs out just as easily as gas. There's gonna be a last one, you know? A last tank of gas. Last piece of food. Uh, I don't think food works like that. What if that? this place is empty? And and the next. And the next. We're not gonna let that happen. Okay? <sighs> okay. I let it have its five minutes. I'm good. Okay, keep on searching. Robin's being a meanie. Stop being a meanie. Meanies aren't allowed in this. <laughs> that could hold a lot of gas. They could be really handy if we one. stayed for a while. Once this car made someone very happy. Now it sits here, rotting away. Así es la vida. Damn, Javi. You getting a bit emo here? Oh, fuck! Shit, 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 shit! Oh, I hate when that happens! Okay, let's continue. What the hell happened to his hands? Ugh, not much. But every bit helps. Want to make sure I check everything. Oh, we have free people. Uh, I don't think these tires would fit the van. I wouldn't have minded having one of these back in the day. Come to Papa. Barely anything. I'll need to find more. Let's talk to thee, Gabe. What's going on in there, buddy? I'm in a bad mood, okay? I want it to go away, but... He won't. 
I just wish we weren't always on the road. I like being with other people. It's just Poor kid. We're in that car for so damn long. The AC hasn't worked in ages. And then it ain't my last damn tape. Well, that's a sweet idea. But it's safer to keep moving. I don't know. Maybe just leave me alone. Okay. But if you want to talk later, I'm around. This one looks promising. What can you tell? Bingo. Nothing up there but garbage. Tires, paint cans, old newspaper. <sighs> All that's left in this junkyard is junk. Garbaggio. Some sort of fuel tank. Is making me nervous. Too risky to search up there. Doesn't look stable. Looks like there's more to see up here. Mm, should I stay or should I climb? I say climb. Any luck? Some. But not enough. Gabe? Hey, Gabe. Let's go take a look over there. Gabe? Stay close to Javi. Got it? Oh, all right. Let's go! This is probably gonna be bad, but... We need some story plot points up in here. Well, I mean, it has Look, the option to stay. There's one they never took to pieces. Uh... Good catch. I... 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 Is it just me, or do I hear something from inside that thing? Locked. Still might there be might gas be in the tank though. There might be in there though. So um. Ooh, that that's making me anxious. It it doesn't have the siphon option. It has the open option. <sighs> Shit. Uh, it's locked. All right. Here goes nothing. Crowbars are fun. Fuck yeah. Yay! Let's just make more noise. Look at all that fuel. This is going to take a while. I'm nervous. Oh, nope, I'm not allowed to go. Looks pretty picked over. Come on, Javi. You got this. Hmm. Looks like it came from in there. Gabe, stay close. I'm hearing noises, and it's making me anxious. Any more zombies? 
Ransacked a long time ago. Might be able to get in through the hatch. <sighs> Looks pretty run down. Locked. Fluffy time. Fluffy time. Oh, be careful entering that hole, Javi. There's gonna be a walker, I just know it. Gabe, come check this out. Not the cleanest place. Oh, no muertos, at least. Muertos. Just be careful. Wow. This place is decked out. Oh, it looks pretty comfortable and pretty gross. Are you kidding me? Lucky for you. They put enough preservatives in this stuff to last for centuries. Well, there's enough food in here to keep us going for a long time. Why did she come back here? Oh, check it out. This is actual honest-to-God pudding! Seriously? And it's not just food. There's a mattress. There's blankets. Someone else's mattress. Someone else's blankets. We need to just... Take our gas and get on the road. This place does have a funny feeling about it. And if Muertos were to somehow surround us... Great. Now I'm officially creeped out. Come on, one night. We bunk down, eat a real meal. It would be nice not to sleep in the van for a change. Please. The herd is coming if it's not here already. We should go and get ahead of it. Before it's too late. The fence is reinforced. We'll be fine. We found this. Why can't we just enjoy it? Javi? Can we? We could stretch out. What sleep do you think? Well oh, shit. Fuck. Come on, you know it's not a big deal. We've got guns. We can protect ourselves. The kids are right. We deserve a little break from the van. Yes! <clears throat> kids, go wild. Just stay indoors and keep your ears open. <laughs> just in case. Cool. You can have your own. Oh, guess what? Uh, now, you can really drown us out. I don't know how I always end up being the mean stepmom, and you get to be the cool uncle. We should be able to switch roles now and then. Oh, come on. That's not fair. You're cool to me. Wow. 
That means so much, really. Grab some gas. We're out of here in a few hours. Hey, uh, wait, but you... You're the cool one, remember? She'd expect it from you. Aww. What the fuck do you think you're doing with our gas? Go on, speak up! Whoa, whoa, look, the, the gas is all there. You just keep it. Yeah, I'm thinking it's a little too late for that. You ain't the loner type. I can tell. I know you got people. Look, don't worry about them. They took off and then they're not coming back. Just up and left you, huh? <laughs> Fan out and look for the others. Lonnie, you're with me. Fuck. Hey! You assholes in there! I got your boy! You don't want him getting shot, you best come out there careful with your hands up! Go on, you first. You get ambushed by your own people, that shit's gonna make my day. Open it real slowly. Looks like you and your friends had a real feast, huh? You can't just take what you like. I don't roll over like that. Look, look, I I'll get you more food. Okay, I can replace everything, I, That's I swear. That's the goddamn least you can do. Look, I, I, I get it, all right? You're starving. Who the fuck is it? At the end of your rope, thought you hit pay dirt. Honest mistake. But I got this sneaky fucking feeling. <clears throat> That you're full of shit. I ain't gonna let it be like the last time some assholes rolled on us. Keep an eye on this dickhead. I'm gonna grab some cuffs. You got it. Just chill, okay? No need to make this any harder. Look, your buddy's not thinking straight. So let's talk, okay? You and me, we can get this sorted out. No, it's his call. Look, man, this doesn't have to go. What the fuck was that noise? What you got hiding under there, boy? If you know something, you better spill it. You don't want me finding out for myself. Fuck! <laughs> Guys, get the fuck in here! Sorry. <sighs> oh. Holy shit! You have to pay for what you've done here. Wait, 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 don't you! Fuck. Hey, my family, where are they? What did you do with my family? Please, man! Just do us both a favor and pretend you're still asleep. I wouldn't start talking if I were you. You're lucky we do things a certain way. I'm already tempted to put a bullet in your brain for what you did to Lonnie back there. If we start talking, I'm gonna get angry. There's gotta be a way we can work all this out. You know, make a deal or something. It ain't my call, all right? 
You best be glad it ain't. Please, just s stop, all right? You don't want me riled up, kid. Not another word, or God help me, I'll put you to sleep myself. We still got a haul ahead of us, and I'm not about to listen to you. What the hell? Stop! Stop! Oh, shit! No, no, no! Okay, puppy snuggling is over. Um, what did I miss? Hey! Shit! Oh, fuck! Good. Just keep looking <gasps> forward. Things went wrong real quick. Um, uh... Look, I'm no threat to you, okay? I surrender. Well, that's obvious. Seeing how you didn't shoot that guy. Clementine? Yes! Baby okay. girl! No, don't do anything stupid. Because I'm not as nice as you. I won't hesitate. You're a kid. Well, wait, did you do that? Well, With the shit, tree? okay. I was trying to stop the truck. Oh, shit. What do you need the truck for? To drive. Put your hands up and close your eyes. Look, I'm the victim here. We're all victims. Oh, so it's okay for you to rob me? This is payment for saving you. Hey, that's for my niece. She loves chocolate more than anything. I promised it to her. Please. Keep your eyes closed and count to a hundred before you go. Wait, just... My family. I need to get back to them. We were attacked and I don't... Look, I just need to know where I am. We were driving down the 522 and, and that's when we found the junkyard. They're still there. I need to get back to them. I know where that is. You said you were driving? In our van, yeah. I'll take you to the junkyard, if you let me have your van. I get you there in one piece, then I drive away. Yeah, absolutely. You got a deal. Good. Let's go. Ooh, Is this really necessary? I don't know you, I don't trust you, and I'm not taking any chances. So it's safer for both of us if you're tied up. Look, I get it. You're being cautious. Glad we understand each other. The name's Javier, by the way. People call me Javi. Clementine. Now well, it's nice to meet you, Clementine. If you say so. <laughs> You don't want to talk? Fine. But how about you give me that gun back so I can at least defend myself? For all I'd know, you'd turn around and use it on me. 
You give me a weapon, we can protect each other. I give you a weapon, I can't take my eyes off you. At least this way I know what I'm up against. Um, computer. Oh, computer, no. please. Muertos. The herd caught up with us. It froze on a really nice shot of Clementine. So that's good. <laughs> That's my girl! Muertos. What do you call them? Walkers. Well, what do you call the ones that run? They're all fucking walkers, okay? Look, I'm just... I'm not used to being around other people. Not for a while, anyway. Usually, it's just me on my own. Sounds kind of lonely, if you ask me. Well, I didn't ask you. And, anyway, I prefer it like that. No, you don't. So, who's at this junkyard? My brother's kids. And his wife. It's impressive, surviving this long. Not sure how you did it. Just keeping everyone together like that. Well, I didn't do it alone. My, uh, well, uh, Kate helped. She did most of the work, actually. Sounds nice, having a partner. It is. Well, how about you? You must have been pretty young when this shit started. I was. But some people looked out for me, too. What happened to them? Same thing that happens to everyone. Oh. Lee. Shit. We can't stay here. There's a town up ahead. We can stay there until the herd passes. Otherwise, we're walker food. Can you do that, please? We can't make a detour. I need to get to my family. And I need that van. But right now, you have to trust me. Oh, you mean the way you trust me? Don't make me regret this. Come on! Oh, boy. There! Fuck. Get to the gate! Let's keep going! They'll open up! Shit! Hey! Open up! She's like, how dare you cheat on me with a puppy? I can't open the gate till you clear them out! Can't risk it. Fuck! These bullets won't fire. <laughs> Get your ass inside! Come on, now! Whoa! God effing damn it, Francine. One of these days, those doors are gonna close, and your ass will be on the other side. <laughs> yeah, and when that day comes, Trip, I promise I'll eat you first. <laughs> it's Clementine, right? You staying a while this time? No. Once the walkers pass, I'm taking this guy to a junkyard off the highway. My family might be trapped there. Hiding from some very bad dudes. Well, shit. I'm truly sorry to hear that. This herd rolled in pretty quick. We're hoping it's gone just as fast. So, just keep your heads down and steer clear of trouble. You got me? There's too much going on outside the walls tonight. We'll be cool. Just need a place to ride out the herd, that's all. All right, I'm gonna hold you to that. And I wouldn't recommend changing your mind if you wanna hang on to all your teeth, that is. Oof. Now head on in, I got shit to do. Well, welcome to Prescott. It's 
It's a pretty cool place, actually. Built from an old airstrip, I guess. The people, on the other hand, they're not my favorite. Usually I'm in and out as quick as I can manage. Not exactly an option this time, though. Hey, what's the problem? You have some sort of history here that I should know about? Not really. I just... I know what people are capable of. Hey, Javi. What's... what's up? My family... They're still out there. If you guys made it this long, I I'm sure you know... They'll know what to do. Hopefully. Let's go. This way. I gotta see a guy about some bullets. Jeez. I haven't been in a place like this since... Well... You know, it's just like the old days. Listen, I gotta take care of something. Hang tight. Well, wait, wait. What should I do? I don't know. Why don't you make some friends? Billiard table. Looks like someone's in the middle of a game. I wonder where they found this old thing. I haven't seen one of these in years. Excuse me. Oh, you again. <laughs> you got some moves, I'll give you that. Hold on a minute. Don't I note you from somewhere? I don't know. Maybe. Garcia. Javier Garcia. For what it's worth, I think you got screwed on the gambling thing. A lifetime ban. Shit. Should've had a 20-year career. The way I see it, nothing wrong with betting on yourself to win. <laughs> and that got a lifetime ban? You want an autograph or something? <laughs> if I had a baseball, I'd take you up on it. But I'm fresh out. Anyway, I'm Conrad. This here's Francine. He runs the place? I just take his money. <laughs> yeah, well, maybe I'm just letting you win. Oh, actually, if you're the gambling type, game's poker. Five card stud. I'll raise you. What do you think? Should I call or should I fold? I know nothing about mm, poker! Don't get too intimidated. I lose more often than I care to admit. Though all it takes is one good hand. I don't really gamble anymore. Went all in on the wrong hand once. <laughs> it's okay, hon. I got this one. Raise. Moment of truth. Flip them. Oh my. Ain't that a pretty sight. Oh, hell yeah! Nice. Well, calm down, both of you. Bottoms up. Wow, man, this smells like turpentine. <laughs> That's the weak stuff. Don't turn away from me. I'm talking to you. Oh, shit. Hey, what's the point in talking when I already told you a deal is a deal? And it's done. What's going on? This guy ripped me off. I traded him a crate of perfectly good batteries. And he gave me a box of bullets that won't Man, fire. I, I he could have gotten both stupid. of us killed. I don't even know if you can hear oh, me yeah. right now. And who the fuck are you, a bodyguard you. or something? Cause I don't scare easy, all right? She doesn't need a bodyguard. She can take care of herself. Believe me. Uh, well, you can't even prove those are the bullets I traded you. Oh, hey, Clem, come on. He knows the bullets don't work. Listen to him. He's not even nervous. <gasps> I could have died because of his bullets. Unfucking believable. Look out! <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Shit! Hey, listen. 
this all cool down, huh? You were acting crazy, I was too. We just got a little out of hand. That's all. Just give me what I'm owed. Jesus, you gotta get her under control, man. This ain't no way to do business. Boy, you have it wrong, buddy. I don't control her, which looks like bad news for you. We had a deal. All right, hey, okay, all right, so, hey, we'll, we'll trade back. I'll find some batteries. I don't need batteries. What I need are bullets that won't get me killed. Oh. Oh, my God. Oh, no. Oh, no. Drop the gun. Right now! Say he attacked you and that he was going for his gun. I fucking warned you! Eli attacked him. I only shot because... Shut it! You done enough talking. Did he die? Drop it. There's a herd out there and you're firing off a fucking... What the fuck happened here? He attacked Javi, okay? It was self-defense. Enough from you. Did she really have to shoot? Fuck. She was just demonstrating that the bullets he sold her were faulty and the gun went off. What are you doing? All right, outside. You and me are going to have a little talk. I'm telling you, he stop. was... Stop. Just stop talking. And you, thanks for being straight with me. Go find Eleanor. She'll fix you up. Till her trip sent you. Now move it. All right, all right. Ugh. Oh boy. Here you go. Try and get some rest, okay? Thanks, Eleanor. Eleanor! She's a sweetie. Ugh, that looks like a nasty cut. Oh, that must have hurt. Well, you've come to the right place. I've had a lot worse, believe me. Have a seat. I'll take a look. My name's Eleanor. Javier. Call me Javi. A little lower and you might have lost an eye. And that is not something you want to mess around with. Okay, I think I'm well, back. Uh, you know, thanks for doing this. I appreciate it. Yay! I wasn't You're getting back. any rest tonight anyway. Might it's as well keep busy. But on. I appreciate the thank you. So, I have to ask, is it true? What's that? I heard you were with that girl, Clementine. You put a bullet in some guy's brain over in the hangar. Don't act so surprised. News travels fast around here. Uh, that's only sort of true. She didn't mean to kill him. It just sort of happened. Why is it always the pretty ones who end up causing the most trouble? <sighs> I've never understood it. A 60 view. See, that's where you got me wrong. Gay. I'm the furthest thing there is from trouble. Yeah, well, we'll see about that. Look, I know you didn't pull the trigger, but that girl, Clementine, there's something cold behind her eyes. I don't know. Maybe she's just a scared kid. <sighs> I don't really know much at all. We just met a few hours ago. Hmm. Wait, I heard it. You two were pretty chummy before things got all... Out of hand, a hanger. She's helping me find my family. We were attacked earlier this evening. Oh, shit. I'm sorry. For family to make it this far? Not everybody gets that. I'm the one who's lucky. I'm not sure I'd have made it this long without the three of them. Hang in there. You're gonna find them. Oh, God, <laughs> Let go of me! There you go. Trip. what's going on? Clementine and I had a little talk. He's letting us leave once the herd passes. Oh, I'm gonna do more than that. I'm gonna hightail you two to that junkyard myself. Cause frankly, I don't want her anywhere near this town. We'll leave sometime tomorrow, when it's safe. You two can spend the night here in the infirmary. I'll see you in the morning. Look, maybe there's another way. We've got a rear gate. Down at the other end of the airfield. We don't use it much, but... Well, we could leave tonight. All three of us. 
Slip past the herd, get a jump start on reaching that junkyard? It's too risky, and if Muertos were to somehow surround us, we... Don't worry. It'll be fine. Anyway, think about it. I've got to check on some patients, but I'll be back in an hour. Whoa, wait a second. Why are you helping me? Well, you told me you aren't in any trouble. So, I'm gonna take your word on it. Huh. I never would have guessed she had it in her. Yeah. She's... She's something. The thing is, I still trust Trip more than I trust her. But hey, it's your call. Once we get to the junkyard, I get my van and we go our separate ways. Okay. Go with You're Trip right. in the morning. Trip's got more muscle, just in case. We'll wait and get a ride with him. You know, when you're out on your own, you can never really let your guard down. I was expecting you to defend me. Instead, you threw me under the bus. You basically sold me down the river earlier. Our deal doesn't include me lying for you. You attacked him, and then you murdered him. I didn't mean to. I had no idea the gun would go off. <sighs> Just goes to show you, you can never really count on anyone else. Clementine, I... I'm done talking. Fuck. It'll be a while before that herd passes, and I want to catch as much sleep as I can. Good night. Oh. Shit, man. Hey, what you drawing there, goofball? Can I see? It's AJ! <sighs> you know I'm no good at this game, but I'll try to guess what it is. Just give me a second. I'll figure it out. It's a doggy, right? It's me? <sighs> it looks just like me. Come on, can you say Clem, AJ? Give it a try. Clem. Not much of a talker, are you, goofball? Edith says you should be speaking by now, but... Don't worry about it. You'll talk when you're ready. That was weird. Clem, open up. It's me. Edith, what's wrong? The group from last week. They're back. And now they're armed. This is bad, Clem. Th th there's a lot of them. Too many of them. I, I don't like the looks of it. What do they want from us? M more than we can give. And, and now they're angry. Just pack whatever you can. Be ready to run, just in case. They got a lot of cars and they're seriously pissed off. This is gonna get ugly. I know oh, it. No. And pack your stuff. When I get back, we gotta get the hell out. Shit, shit, shit. Bear essentials. Come on. We fucking begged you, man! Our people are sick and starving! It didn't have to be this way. You could have just given us some grub, some medicine, that's it. This is your fault. Y'all are just hoarding it for your fucking... Clem! Clem! They're inside! We have to go now! I hope I got the stuff that I needed. Run, 
Hey, Clem. We almost there. Uh, Clementine. Yeah, we're close. I gotta say, I hope your people are safe and sound. Eleanor asked me before we left to make sure of it. Oh, yeah? Yes, sir. So that's what I'm gonna do. Though why she went to bat for you, I've got no idea. I mean, she hardly even knows you. And you don't know her, for that matter. Makes a guy wonder, you know? You know there's not much mystery to a trip. She's a good human being. Yeah. Eleanor's got a big heart. That's for damn sure. Guys, that's the place. Oh, shit. What a mess. Jesus. Must have been hundreds of them. Kate's good in a crisis. She'd know how to get shelter. What's that? I'm a smart boy. Mariana's tape player. Mariana? Mariana, are you here? Javi! Oh my god! You're safe! I can't believe it! You told me where to hide. I just listened to what you said. Lock yourself in and don't come out, not even once it's quiet. It kept running through my head like on a loop. I don't even know how long I was in there. You did exactly what you should have done. I always knew you were a smart kid. It was scary at first, but once the muertos couldn't see me anymore, they just passed by. Kate, and your brother, where are they? We got pulled apart when that huge bunch of muertos showed up. Kate yelled that they were gonna try to make it back to the van. Then that's where we're headed. Let's go find your brother, sweetheart. Oh no. No. No sign of them. They must have seen it like this, then gone someplace else to hide. Kate. They're trapped in there. Mariana, stay back. Gross. Come on. I think we get a pass. Oh. <laughs> I, I wanted to come after you. I, I swear I did. You don't have to snot all over my shirt about it. I thought we were dead. Like, never gonna see you again dead. We only had a couple bullets left. Oh, I thought we were done for. There's no way I would let that happen. Yeah, well, you weren't here. The herd showed up and Mariana was gone and we were waiting and, and waiting and then... I was just so scared. I'm here now. You don't have to be scared. Hey, you hurt yourself. You must have scraped it in the truck. Didn't even notice. Hey, at least it's not a bite. Well, not much we can do about it here. I've got a lady friend who's a doctor. As soon as we get back to Prescott, she'll patch you right up. I'm Trip, by the way. Pleasure to make your acquaintance. We should be getting back. Don't want to push her luck. Who's the kid with the gun? She have a name you want to share with us? Or are you going to make me do my own introductions? She saved my life. Pulled this crazy stunt. 
Let me get the upper hand on the asshole who took me away from you guys. Her name's Clementine. Hi there. Glad I was able to help. Well, we're very grateful to you. Really. There's a town nearby. It's safe. I like the sound of that. Oh my god. Javi, do they have hot water? Even, like, lukewarm water would be okay. Ugh, oh, and bubble bath. Wouldn't bubble bath be amazing? Eh, don't get your hopes up too high. It's a nice place, but it's not the Ritz. Well, whatever they've got, I'm sure it's gonna be great. Between you and me, these kinds of missions don't usually go so well. Uh, but you found every single one of your people. Way to jinx And you found us. them alive. Healthy. Reasonably cheerful. Well, let's wait to celebrate until we're back behind the walls, okay? I don't want to jinx us. Well, some things are worth saying woohoo about, that's all. When we get back to Prescott, you still owe me a working ride. I haven't forgotten about our deal. You couldn't have known what happened to your van, but still, I need some way out of here. I was hoping you might stay. You know, considering... Considering what? You came all the way out here with me. Yeah, for the van, not for... Cool. <gasps> no! Thanks. No! Mari! I don't think so! Javi! We can't leave her! Oh! oh. Shit! Oh. Kate! <coughs> Stop! Uh. Stop! Help! Do something, Javi! Just do something! I know, Javi, and there'll be time for all that, but not right now. Kate needs a doctor. <sighs> Which means we gotta go. We got a window here, man. Kate? Are you okay? I'm fine. <sighs> really? <sighs> she's not. And the longer it takes us to get out of here, the worse off she's gonna be. It's time to go, man. We stay here and we finish this. Are you fucking nuts? We gotta get the fuck out of here right now! I already now. killed one of you. If we don't stop them, they're gonna come after your family again. Let Trip help them. You stay with me. What? No, uh, Javi, you have to come with us. Javi, please! Trust me, Javi. We have to end this now. No, Javi, please come with us. I have to stay with my family. Go, I'll hold him off. I said go. Oh Kate. God! Kate, that wake bumpy up. ride's gotta Kate. gonna jostle her alive. Oh shit! Oh fuck! 
Oke. Shit, man. Well, that's it for episode one of The Walking Dead, season three. Woo, boy. That was a lot. Thanks for watching.